It's been a year since North Korea's Jiang Song Tech, who was seen as one of the most important links between China and North Korea, was purged and then very quickly executed. Experts say the chill is still being felt between China and North Korea, but the North might have found a new friend. Our Yi Jun has more. It wasn't welcome news for China last year when it heard North Korea's young leader Kim Jong Un had purged his uncle Chang Song Tech. Zhang was well known for supporting closer ties with China, especially for Beijing backed economic reforms. A year has passed, but China and North Korea relations are still feeling the strain from Zhang's execution. The number of political exchanges between the two countries has fallen sharply. In fact, in July, the Chinese president visited South Korea first, skipping the traditional stopover in Pyongyang. As for their economic ties, the two countries were looking to develop North Korea's Nasun and Hwakumpyong special economic zones. However, these projects hit a major speed bump after Zhang's death. China's trade with North Korea also dropped by about 3 percent in the second quarter of 2014 to 1.3 billion U.S. dollars, although it still accounts for most of North Korea's foreign trade. As for North Korea's nuclear test threats, Beijing was unusually bold in its criticism and agreed to the tightening of UN Security Council sanctions on the regime. While North Korea may be losing China, it's actually making friends with Russia. Despite growing international condemnation of North Korea's human rights violations, the North continues to cozy up with Moscow. Despite criticism toward its nuclear program and human rights violations, North Korea is still managing to continue its diplomatic efforts with Russia. However, experts do say that while China and North Korea relations are strained now, there's a chance the two might make up in the near future and be back on the same page once again. Lee Jun, Arirang News.